all right. This video is sponsored by Storyblocks. See, last summer during my trip to Europe, the main goal was to lean into whatever opportunities arose. Two months for plans to fall apart, two months for new friendships and experiences, two months to be swept up by the breeze of life, and two months to live a little more. And so, it was within this chaos that an artist from Australia and a YouTuber from Michigan meet and see an idea to travel Norway together. What follows is a collection of moments and memories from our seven day road trip together in the most beautiful country that I've ever traveled through. Welcome back are, to the channel. What are we doing right now? We're going to Norway. We're going to Norway. We are going to Norway. <laughs> <laughs> Not a bucket. Fin Hello. 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 Hello.
What is that? <laughs> we are up in the mountains, so it's really cold, and so we're blasting the heat. I think tonight's gonna be the coldest night. We'll see. Anything to say? <laughs> Stay woke. Stay woke. <laughs> this gremlin. Look at this troll. Whoa! <laughs> Simon stenched up the car. Phoebe smells like tuna. Simon smells worse. Yeah, yeah. It's not wholesome, Simon. It's stinky, Simon. <laughs> It's not fine. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back. Oh. Sounds like we're in a spaceship that's about to like malfunction. Hey guys, no, welcome I back. didn't say anything on voice control. No, my. <sighs> Sometimes I don't know what's going on in his head. What? What do you mean? Doosh. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This place is unreal. <laughs> so happy right now. Check out this. This is so crazy. PB and then Shiba Saki. Hello, I'm with Miss Phoebe Lee. Phoebe Lee, how are you feeling right now? I'm feeling incredible. Yeah. Yeah, re energized, refreshed. Mm. How do you feel about this trip now? Because this is our technically last day before we go back to the city. Oh my gosh. I don't know. I just want it to be longer, I think. And oh. yeah, it's been incredible just being in nature and looking at how big these mountains are like honestly we are so tiny we are s such tiny little yeah. people in this freaking universe it's crazy simon's so annoying though i just i can't deal with him Phoebe still smells like tuna <laughs> since the first simon day has a stench. Simon. i feel like i've like learned so much about myself and what i really want to do and yeah i think as we talked about before like the idea of slow living and finding rest is so important when you're a human, you know, like we're not robots, we can't just be working day and night 24-7. Yeah. Because you are you're a workaholic like me. I am not a <laughs> I'm okay. Let me clarify this. I'm not a workaholic, I'm addicted sure. to flow. I'm addicted to the flow. It just sounds like saying I'm not addicted to cigarettes, but I'm addicted to nicotine. Yeah, no, drugs aren't bad. <laughs> Addiction is bad. And what is a message you want to tell to yourself watching this on August 11th, 2024? Oh my gosh, I'll be so old then. To remember your Europe trip and don't forget to look back on how much you've accomplished instead of always looking forward in what you want to accomplish. Mm. And just be easy on yourself and not take life too seriously mm. yeah. I like that and then what's your biggest goal for this next year? my biggest goal is to work hard get <laughs> money! you meet a lot of really cool people on the road and Phoebe was definitely not an exception my original return date from Europe was actually a week before Norway and if I didn't extend this would have never happened so I'm really glad it worked out the way it did so thank you Phoebe for showing me how to live a little lighter.
to not take everything so seriously, and for being the best companion in the most beautiful country I've ever been to. This adventure was only possible because of Storyblocks. You guys probably know by now, but if you guys aren't familiar, Storyblocks is a massive stock media content library. They have everything from royalty-free music, videos, images, and sound effects, and much more. They make it super easy. I actually ended up using a lot of Storyblocks drone footage in this video of Norway, as well as using it in a transition scene where I didn't have a certain shot that I wanted to get. It was really easy. I looked up plane, and then I also looked up plane sound effect, and it just added up really easy and made the process so much lighter. Storyblox constantly refreshes their library based on customer demand so you know it's up to date and also gets you completely covered on the legal side of things so you don't need to worry, you can just focus on creating. I find it really nice for situations like this where I go on a trip um, but I might not have filmed as much as I wanted to. If I have a specific shot in my mind or something I want to use for a transition, I can just look it up on Storyblocks and make it happen. So if you guys are interested in leveling up your filmmaking game or just supporting this channel, you can head over to www.storyblocks.com slash wholesomesimon or the link in my description to get started on unlimited stock media downloads for one set price. Thank you again, Storyblocks, for sponsoring and supporting the channel and these adventures. Had a lot of fun on this one. Similar style to the last one, just keeping a lot more chill, not trying to force a story where maybe a story doesn't need to exist. Not everything has to be that deep, right? Much love. Thank you again, Storyblocks, for supporting the channel. And yeah, I'll see you guys soon.